Maximum Velocity Sports, uh, we're showing you a new product that we have developed called the Launch Angle Pro. This is the only device on the market, or I should say the only affordable device on the market that will allow you to train at the specific launch angle that you want to train at. All right, there's a lot of talk out there with launch angle, and we see it on MLB Tonight, and kids are seeing it. All right, we developed this product really more for kids because they need to understand realistically how far they can hit the baseball. Right? 8, 9, 10, 11 year old, 12 year olds, even 13, the majority of them are not home run hitters yet. They may be, it all depends on their maturity level. This device allows you to train at whatever launch angle matches your exit velocity. Even if you don't know your exit velocity, this is gonna give you a reference point to focus on for your T work. It's an adjustable target where you can put a range of launch angles in. You have a launch angle dial right here. You can dial it into whatever launch angle that you want. We're gonna demonstrate it on the Baxman T. We think this is an elite T for, for T work training, especially for launch angle training. All right, this ball is gonna go in and you're gonna be focusing on the bottom half of the baseball. All right, in order to hit the baseball up, you gotta hit the bottom half of the baseball. In order to hit more doubles, triples, and home runs, you have to hit the bottom half of the baseball. And any, any top half of the baseball is going to be a ground ball, which you have a higher percentage of making it out. All right, so we're going to demonstrate this, and it's going to be challenging. It's going to be very challenging. All right, it's going to make you a much better hitter. It's going to make you understand how, how to hit. It's going to make you understand how your body works. You're going to be able to work one-on-one. On, one on one. I've been a high school coach for over 20 years. Um, being able to train by yourself and to really understand your swing. You know, we think it's a very important component of being a, an all-around baseball player. And so this allows you to really train with a purpose. So we've set this now, this is adjust vertically. So you have to make sure that, that the beam is set exactly at the height of the baseball, which right now we're at that height. You can adjust this as high as you want. It goes up to six feet high. You won't need to put it that high. Well, right now we're at a five degree launch angle. We're gonna train right now at about 15 degrees, we're gonna be training up the middle. We're also gonna train, we're gonna show some demos, going to left center field and to right center field. With all of these pitches, well, your swing has to change. Your body movement has to change, right? You, do, you can do that without the Launch Angle Pro, but with the Launch Angle Pro, it's, it's, it's really making you focus. It's making you focus on every single, single swing that you take. Right? And off of the backspin tee, you know, it's gonna really challenge you to, to be an elite hitter. All right, so again, this is at 15 degrees. We're going to take a few swings and show you here. <clears throat> right, you're training your muscle memory. Right, right now, we're training our muscle memory on a pitch. Right, we're training for fastballs. Right, that's the pitch you're looking to drive. When you get the fastball, you're looking to drive the fastball. The curveball, the changeup, those are pitcher pitches. Right, we try to avoid them unless you're in a two strike count. Right, when you're in a two strike count, your approach changes totally. Right, you should, your T work should be focusing on driving that ball at the launch angle that you want, right, where you want to put it. <clears throat> All right. So, going up the middle, we did fine. Now we're going to go to left center field. We're going to have to open up my hips a little bit earlier. I'm going to have to get that ball out in front a little bit more. All right, so now I have to make that adjustment. Right, I've been playing baseball for, for many years. I might, it might look kind of easy what I'm doing here. It, it is not easy at all, especially for youth. Right, and this is good for any age, eight-year-old all the way up to the major leagues. All right, so now we're at 15 degrees. I'm actually going to change it a little bit. I want to drive this ball in the left center field gap. I want to get it to the fence. So I'm going to go a little bit higher. I'm going to go, I'm going to go to about 20 degrees, about 20 degrees there. All right, so now I'm going to have to change right path my bat. I need to get that bat on the plane that I want it to be at to get it at that 20 degree launch angle. All right, the ball's coming in on one plane, we have to get the bat on that plane to meet it. Let's see how we do here. <clears throat> I've done a lot of tee training. I see kids do tee training. Right? The only feedback we really get is whether we squared the ball up or not. Right? So now not, we're going to square up the ball and we're going to know the exact launch angle that we're hitting at. Right? Combine that with our exit velocity, we can give ourselves an idea of how far we can hit that ball. Or we're going to know how far we can hit that ball based on those numbers. 
Again, going left center. All right, and then again, now, with, now we can work going opposite way. And this is all at 20 degrees. We can then adjust it up or down however we would like. All right. I know most hitters struggle with going the opposite way. Real tendency to really drop their back shoulder. All right, so now right, we're really gonna train and see how off we are. All right, let the ball get a little bit deeper. And again, this, this tee is just phenomenal you know, for this training, right? Because you're seeing the important part of the ball. Right? This is the part of the ball that you need to hit right? to get backspin, to get that ball up in the air, and to drive it. And if you have a low exit velocity, you have to change your launch angle. So that one I, I felt that I totally dropped off the ball there. All right, so now I'm going to make that adjustment to make sure I do it right this time. All right, not bad. And if we want, we want to go a little bit lower. All right, I want to go just line drive, get that right over the infielder's heads. Or maybe drop it down to about 10 degrees. Or I want to work on a lower pitch. I'm going to put it down there. I'm going to adjust my T to the same height. All right, so now I'm working at a different, different height ball. I've adjusted my launch angle to be right there. Now I'm going to be swinging differently. So I felt right there, I felt myself roll over. I felt my weight shift come through too soon. All right, I wasn't on time. It's gonna tell you if you're on time or not. All right, you need to be on time to maximize, to maximize your body with your swings. Right, so I just did it again. So you can see here with the height adjustment, right, I have more trouble with this little bit lower of a pitch. All right, so I'm struggling with that. I'm gonna keep training at that until I get that down. All right, that was better. Now, if I didn't have this pointer, this reference point to look at, no, I would think they were pretty decent hits. Well, not that I'm still hitting the ball hard. You always want to hit the ball hard mentality. Right? When you have two strikes, your approach changes. Not bad, I'm getting closer there, but I, have to, I still have to make some type of adjustment. I need to get myself, I don't want to use the word drop my back shoulder, but I have to get on the right plane Right, to get that ball at that, launch, at that launch angle that I want. Boom, there we go. So, launch Angle Pro, demonstrated here with Baxman T. All right, excellent T. Again, focusing on the important part of the ball to get that launch angle. All right, you can get this for under 100 bucks at MaximumVelocitySports.com or uh, Amazon.com. All right, take your T training to a whole new level. Thanks for watching.